adiabatic flame temperature a very common word in combustion what is mean by adiabatic flame temperature is that suppose a fuel is burned in a control volume or in a closed system then uh, it assumes that all the heat transfer is zero and all the work input and output is zero and the whole heating value of the fuel whole heating value of the fuel is converted to flame it's and this flame temperature is called adiabatic flame temperature and this can be find by the following relations by chemical equations and that is suppose for example we are uh, methane is oxidized in air so by this we can form a balance equation and this is the balance equation is that and after that we law the we write the first law of thermodynamics this is the heat transfer this is the work input and output means work interaction and this is the change in the internal energy of the system which we can see consider this and we know enthalpy is equals to u plus pv internal energy and the flow work and then u is equals to h minus pv and the change in internal energy is equals to change in enthalpy and change in pv and this can be write, can be written as, as nrt and this can be replaced in above equation this and this can be written as so for the assumptions as per the assumptions for adiabatic flame temperature work should be zero work interaction should be zero and this implies that the change in that this should be zero this means h1 minus should be is equals to actually this means product minus reactant should be zero and this implies that should be equal to this and for the above equation for methane we can write for for products as mole of co2 enthalpy of formation of co2 plus enthalpy chain suppose after this reaction temperature we don't know at time t at temperature t for co2 plus mole number of moles of water enthalpy of formation of water plus enthalpy change at time t plus mole of nitrogen enthalpy of formation of nitrogen plus enthalpy change up to time t up to, up to temperature d and this is and for pro and for reactant and for reactant we can write as number of mole of methane means the fuel enthalpy of formation and enth number of mole of oxygen and number of mole of nitrogen 
for reactant as we know from previous previously we know that the starting in the in the very starting the temperature was 25 degrees centigrade and 1 atm pressure so at that condition enthalpy formation of oxygen should be zero and should be zero enthalpy formation of nitrogen should be zero and should be zero so this implies that enthalpy formation of fuel itself and this is what enthalpy of formation of CH4 means the methane and this must be equated must be equated to the product in this way but still we have the unknown temperature up to what temperature the, the products presently are in and that temperature is known as the A of T so here we assume one value for the temperature or the AFT assume the value and that is the AFT means adiabatic flame temperature and suppose we have 23 Kelvin and therefore enthalpy of product should be calculated at this temperature and 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 after that we should observe we should observe whether enthalpy of reactant is equals to enthalpy of product is if it holds then assume temperature is the required ft means adiabatic flame temperature and if it not if it not hold if we do not hold then we iterate in further manner for as much as as much as the enthalpy of reactant should be enthalpy of product and this will provide adiabatic flame temperature